Okay, so this is a pull-up video on our previous video, which we said we're going to show you how to use the new uh, Kitten Life object masking. So in this video, we're going to look at how to do that. If you haven't watched our video that is about how to install the plugins into Kitten Life, please watch that video and uh, later you can come back to try it out uh, with this video. So let's get started. So here we have a video clip here. All you want to do is just place this video clip on the timeline. Now, take note that Kettle Life uh, at this time, this uh, object uh, masking does not allow you to go beyond a uh, longer uh, clip. So what we want to do is just uh, put it down to two seconds of the clip just to test this one out. So once you do that, uh, you can see already here you have when you select the clip, you have this little uh, object mask here so what you can do click on it and then you have these properties here to play around with to uh, use to uh, remove the uh, background of this video here so this is a person who we just walk on so what we will do uh, we click on this uh, plus icon here to create new mask so once you do that it's gonna say exporting videos frame for analysis so we just wait it's gonna take only a few seconds to do that Okay, so we already have it here now. What we will do is to, uh, so here we have the video being, uh, the frames are being exported into to be ready to create the mask. So what we can do, just click anywhere on the screen and select the uh, object that you want to uh, create the mask on. This is the rectangle showing the, uh, where we want the mask to be applied to. And now you come to this red button here and you click generate mask. And you see it says generating mask here. So it's going to take a while to do this. It takes more than some minutes. So I think maybe depend on my computer. I don't know. But uh, yeah, it's going to take that time. So uh, just wait patiently until it is ending. Then we'll come back again. So here you can see already we have the mask being created. But it's not being applied to the video itself yet. So what we're going to do, you can see here it says apply the mask. So click on the apply the mask. And you can see it's already applying the must and this is the outcome. Thank you again for watching and see you back again. If you have not subscribed, please do that. Uh, it's going to help us to continue uh, creating more videos. Thank you for those who have subscribed. We really appreciate your uh, support in that regard. And uh, yeah, thank you. See you back again in another video. Okay,